Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another video, and we're gonna go ahead and do Advanced 5. So there's a lot of requirements needed on pretty much everybody. Even, I mean, not that much, but a decent amount of requirements. Thunder resistance, dark resistance, or status immunity, stuff like that. And she can do stat buffs turn one with one of her cooldowns. So here we go. This is the second edition of the hardest boss rush available currently. I already have the first one available on YouTube channel. I'm gonna look at that later. For now, I'll just enjoy this. So these first, you know, few fights are not even anything to worry about. And by the way, this is the normal moon. So before we get too excited that I'm one shotting it, which I've already, I've already two shot the moon. There's kind of Moon, but that's just the normal one. I believe the second one is either the first, or like the regular, or you know, the scorn version of this fight. But I think even if this was the scorn fight, I think we still one shot it anyways. Is it so old at this point? It is incredibly old at this point. I kept thinking that uh, opponent's buff is only for attack and magic, but actually it's for all stats. So yeah, definitely worth doing that for sure. And we're gonna go ahead and put some plant mitigation on too. No, we don't, we don't, that would not be a fair, I don't think. We have not gotten to the point where that Moth can just be put in with any trial at this point. That would not be fun for anybody. I probably wouldn't even do it. I'm gonna be honest, I'm gonna be honest right now, I probably wouldn't even try to do it. Die. I wouldn't have died. I don't know why he doesn't have full moon burst. That's a little strange to me. But here. He just died from that? Are you serious? He died from that. Or she died from that, rather. Really? That was just his weak AoE move. That's never happened before. So that's weird. That's, that's probably my best run I've ever had with this. That's insane damage we took with just the AoE. I 
How do you get the hammer accessory? I think it's just you have to do the king log. Or maybe it's in like one of the like the trial for it. To be honest, I don't remember how I got mine. Okay, ready. I'm ready to feel the pain. Rip. Just couldn't survive, unfortunately. So that's putting us in a really bad spot because we had. I was a, I'm not able to one shot. Um, one shot the typhoon quickly. So now he's gonna do annoying stuff. normally because they're not in sync so can't do fire Be definitely one shot because advance forward one shot it and with this just the prep turn. Well, I don't know if the, he's let's see, I don't know if he's physical or magical. Immune. Okay, he's magic immune, so it's not dead, unfortunately. RNG do not like this. He said again. Well, now we have to one shot him. Pretty sure we'll be able to. Nonsense is over with. This will be edited. I'll edit all that, all those turns down because we didn't do anything special. And here we go with the last fight, which should be done in just a few turns, I'm too sure. See if you can survive one turn or really get wiped. Looking pretty good though. Should 
Should be GG's now, I agree. I agree with that. Should be over. Also, let's just let's just get 15% uh, light damage. Yeah, that's. I don't think we even needed it, but to make it more convincing, we were able to stop it that time. So there we go. All complete. I think all missions are done. Missions are. 15 turns. Wait, yeah. Uh, deal wind damage. Oh, we didn't do only wind damage. Right, that was a different mission. Okay, it doesn't matter. No items is one of them. This is no items. There we go. Got it all done. Uh, I'm gonna show my gear much more slowly for you guys. Because we went a little too fast before. Now Cecil is incredibly decked out though, he has to be. You were seeing that he was still dying a lot, so he needs to be decked out for this. The team composition is really tight because of all the different kind of fights you have to go through. And But really the only fights you have to worry about is team at for the one shot or the two shot and also Malboro Queen, which was the most difficult part of the entire fight. I, I, I personally feel like it's that's the whole thing, because you so you really need, if you're using Kuja, you really need to do like a hybrid killer build, like mine. So this is Dragon Killer Plus, this is Plant Killer Plus, and this is a Shiro's Rod. Um, so yeah, I think it's really worth it to, to try and get some Plant Killer, try to get some Dragon Killer. And then I think that's about it. If I follow through, Type in hashtag uh, queen. Hashtag queen will be the keyword for the ending of this video. Thanks for watching. Any questions, type them down below in the comments. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.